The artifacts dredged up from the ruins go on show for the first time at the British Museum. Deep sea divers have some of the most terrifying jobs in the world. Although the research is fun, especially when extra details are revealed, deep sea diving is more serious than it sounds because you really never know what you may come across. In this video, we explore the 15 strangest things caught on camera by deep sea divers. 15. Sperm Whale Encounter from glowing jellies to burrowing worms, the research crew aboard Nautilus encountered some fascinating marine life they couldn't resist. This sperm whale was filmed from a remotely operated underwater vehicle below the Gulf of Mexico. The animal caught the crew by surprise. Due to their long dive times and ability to travel long distances underwater, these whales are rarely seen on the water's surface. Even remotely operated vehicles have a hard time finding them. This sperm whale seemed curious as it was captured investigating the glowing ROV, allowing the crew to explore it more. Sperm whales dive 2,250 meters deep, searching for squid, their most preferred prey. Although this vehicle traveled 598 meters below the water, it captured the beast. Mature males grow to 16 meters long, but may reach up to 20.7 meters. They have the largest brain on Earth, more than five times heavier than humans. Their oil was a prime target for the whaling industry, as it was used to produce lubricants, candles, and oil lamps. 14. Ice Finger of Death Nature surprises us with the most incredible sightings. This spectacular one is called the Icy Fingers of Death. This strange phenomenon that forms underwater icicles is found in oceans in polar regions. It is rarely captured on camera, so it is a big deal when it makes it to the news. Brinnacle is a finger-like structure that reaches down to the ocean floor and freezes everything in its path, including sea urchins and starfish. A professor who witnessed this firsthand described it as an upside-down cactus blown from glass. He also said they were delicate and could break at the slightest touch. Studies show that when sea ice in the Antarctic and Arctic region freezes, salt and other ions found in seawater are left out. Brine is concentrated in salt water and gathers in various channels and fractures. Since it is heavier than water, the ultra-cold brine sinks into the ocean floor and freezes the seawater it touches on its way down. Therefore, we see the finger-like shape of the brinicles. The downward-facing phenomenon was discovered in the 1960s and is similar to hydrothermal vents. These vents form when ion-rich hot water is ejected from the sea floor, creating a porous metal tower extending upwards. 13. Baltic Sea Anomaly A group of subwater explorers unearthed the Baltic Sea Anomaly in 2011. It is a 60-meter-wide entity with a vast disk twice the size of a football field. It rests in the freezing waters of the Gulf of Bothnia in the Baltic Sea region. Scientists were shocked to see this unprecedented finding, this mystery lies in the waters between Sweden and Finland. It resembles a mushroom rising at three to four meters from the seabed. The main object has three straight edges, boxes drawn, and construction lines. The huge figure on the object resembles an unidentified black material. Many say it is a giant stone or a portal to the other world, while others call it an underwater stonehenge or a strange stone circle formation made by an ancient civilization. The mystery surrounding this entity is still unknown because explorers have not identified why it is at the bottom of the sea. Submerged at depths of nearly 91 meters underwater, it is roundish and has a circumference of about 18 meters. Most scientists investigating the phenomenon have given up on it, saying it is an unidentified flying object. 12. Stonehenge Scientists understand that to trace the origins of ancient civilizations, they need to look underwater. So far, they have found a thing or two that would have been left undiscovered. One such thing is the huge stone structure submerged off the coast of Sicily. This sighting is older and bigger than Stonehenge, believed to be about 5,000 years old. This monolith is the subject of a paper by Emanuele Lodolo, a marine geophysicist at the National Institute of Oceanography and Experimental Geophysics in Italy. This structure is believed to be nearly 12,000 years old. 
It was revealed by an underwater sonar survey in November 2012. It is 12 meters tall and broken in half. It has three holes, one of which passes through the block. Based on research, it was made by humans and didn't occur naturally. Aside from its regular shape and holes of similar diameter, this monolith is made from stone. Its presence suggests serious human activity in the area. Judging from its size, it should weigh at least 15 tons. 11. Bimini Road. There have been stories about a lost city hidden underwater for several decades. Atlantis graced the pages of novels and captured the attention of historians and fantasizers. The famous city first appeared in Plato's Timaeus and Critias. In his book, he claimed that there was a battle between Athenians and Atlanteans. However, Atlantis sank into the sea after they fell short of the mercies of God. With several ancient texts having different narratives, one can hardly know which is true. Many archaeologists have believed in the existence of the Bimini Road, an ancient rock formation off the coast of the Bahamian island. It is said to be connected to the ancient city. It rests 18 feet below the water surface and runs about half a mile before ending in a curving hook. Aside from the road, there are two other smaller linear rock formations similar to it. The Bimini Road is made up of limestone blocks cut in a rectangular shape. Each block on the road is 10 to 13 feet long and 7 to 10 feet wide. The limestone that constitutes this road is a carbonate-cemented shell native to the Bahamas. 10. RMS Republic. A few years before the almighty Titanic sank into North Atlantic's unsafe water, the RMS Republic also went down in a similar incident. The vessel went down almost 300 feet into the shark-infested ocean. It sank with an unimaginable treasure that would make anyone wealthy a few minutes after finding them. The RMS Republic was one of the most beautiful liners of its time. It departed in January 1909 and was heading to the Mediterranean ports amid the dense fog. She survived the night but collided with SS Florida during the day. The slam was so fierce that it destroyed the engine room, which ceased power to the liner. Thankfully, most passengers were rescued, but three lives were still lost. Although rescuers rescued SS Florida, RMS Republic sank deep to the ocean floor. At the time, the ship was the most technologically advanced. Its builders had boated that it was unsinkable. The cargo in the vessel was not spared, and there was no way to retrieve it. Rumors say a lost treasure worth billions of dollars is hidden in this ship. 9. Phantom Jellyfish The giant phantom jellyfish is one of the largest jellyfish species in the world. This famous animal was captured in the depths of Monterey Bay, California. Marine biologists piloting a remote submarine found the creature bobbing along with its bell-shaped head and four long arms. These jellies live up to their name as their bell measures three feet wide and their arms reach lengths of 33 feet. Although they are huge, they are hard to find. After its first discovery in 1899, this elusive sea creature has only been seen 100 times. Researchers have completed thousands of dives to Monterey Bay Aquarium Research Institute and have seen them only nine times. These sea creatures are hidden because they lurk 21,900 feet below the water's surface. This ocean depth is called the Midnight Zone, where sunlight doesn't penetrate. Other fish species, like cuttlefish, giant squid, anglerfish, etc., also live in the zone. Thanks to remotely operated vehicles, we can see these rare animals often. While little is known about this animal, researchers suspect they use their oral arms to tangle up prey and bring them close to their mouth. 8. Giant Unidentified Sea Creature Oil Rig There may never be a time when scientists will explore all parts of the ocean. While divers have successfully swam to the most unassuming areas, some spots have been left undiscovered. Those areas house some unknown sea monsters. This video, released in 2012, proves that some hidden areas in the ocean exist. A deep-sea oil rig video captured a strange creature off the coast of Great Britain. This sighting got everyone talking. Some wondered where the monster came from and what species it represented. Others claimed it was a jellyfish or a used condom. If you guessed it was a jellyfish, you might be close to the answer because it looked like one. Researchers had every reason to believe it wasn't a whale placenta because of the chances of it sinking to 5,000 feet deep water. The creature was found at depths of about 723 meters deep. 
On the opposite sides of the creature were two large, tubular-shaped processes with a yellowish-brown tinge. Don't be shocked to hear that it might be the first and only time scientists would see this kind of creature. Given that 95% of the world's oceans are unexplored, you can guess why the details of this creature remain unknown. 7. Colacanths The Coelacanth is a primitive-looking animal thought to have gone extinct about 65 million years ago. However, in 1938, a South African museum curator on a local trawler ignited a debate about how this bizarre lobe-finned fish fits into the evolution of land animals. There are only two known species of this animal on the planet. The first lives near the Comoros Islands off the east coast of Africa, and the second is found in the waters of Sulawesi, Indonesia. Scientists believe this animal's unique characteristics represent an early step in the evolution of fish to four-legged animals like amphibians. Coelacanths are elusive creatures that live in depths 2,300 feet below the surface. They are huge and can reach up to 6.5 feet large or more. Scientists say they live up to 600 years or more. The most striking feature of this animal is its paired lobe fins that extend away from its body-like legs and move in an alternating pattern. Other outstanding characteristics include a hinged joint in the skull that allows the fish to widen its mouth to catch larger prey. They also have an oil-filled tube that serves as a backbone and thick scales common to only extinct fish. 6. The Apollo Engines when Jeff Bezos said he wanted to explore the ocean, many scientists didn't take him seriously until results began pouring in. The Amazon founder and CEO found components of two F-1 rocket engines, which he verified as engines from Apollo 11. This rocket was the first mission that took U.S. astronauts to the moon. Some decades ago, Neil Armstrong stepped his leg onto the moon, and this finding is a remembrance of the exceptional feat. Bezos congratulated the team for the feat as they assured him of doing more to find more details. The F-1 engines powered the Saturn V rocket carrying Neil Armstrong, Michael Collins, and Buzz Aldrin on the Apollo 11 mission. At an altitude of 38 miles, the engines separated. Its parts were considered lost and destroyed forever. While Bezos wanted to find these engines, he knew the serial numbers were missing, making them difficult to find. Each engine weighs almost 9 tons and comes in a cluster of 5. They provided the machine with 32 million horsepower while burning 6,000 pounds of fuel every second. After its separation, the rocket engines made their re-entry at 5,000 miles per hour. The technology used for this recovery mission is as otherworldly as the Apollo technology. 5. Cenote Angelita Below the Cenote Angelita Cave in the Yucatan Peninsula lies strange underground flowing water. This beautiful natural phenomenon is thanks to the presence of hydrogen sulfide. This compound is heavier than salt water, deposited at the bottom of the river and forms a distinct layer that serves as an underwater river. This river reaches depths of over 100 meters and has several alternating fresh and salt water. The colorful branches and foliage of the nearby trees floating along the riverbanks add to the beauty of this water. The cenote describes a cave with fresh water. It is also used to define a sinkhole in many parts of the world, especially Central America. The ancient Mayan people considered it sacred and used it to celebrate religious rites and human rituals. You must be well girded to visit this cave, as it is not for the faint of heart. The water is clear for the first 20 meters, but suddenly becomes murky as one dives deeper. The dive goes as deep as 55 meters below water and accommodates only experienced divers. 4. Lost City Underwater Scientists have lost count of how many lost cities exist. However, they have details of some, like Thonis Heracleion in ancient Egypt. This city is one of the greatest discoveries underwater. Its existence is recorded in a few inscriptions of ancient texts but these writings were not detailed about the address. The port flourished at the mouth of the Nile in the 7th century BC. It was a vital center for trade and culture during its heydays, but soon disappeared after it was flooded. Heracloan was located 32 kilometers northeast of Alexandria on the Mediterranean Sea. Studies show that the city served Egyptians and Greeks and was known by its native name. Its mythical beginning dates back to the 12th century, and its importance grew exceedingly during the last days of the pharaohs. 
By the end of the 2nd century BC, the land where this city was built suffered soil liquefaction. While a few residents remained afterward, the city sank underwater by the end of the 8th century AD. 3. Crop Circles One of the greatest finds by deep sea divers is the crop circles underwater. Japanese photographer Yoji Okata captured the circles while on a dive near Amami Oshima at the southern tip of Japan. He said the sand patterns are almost 6 feet in diameter and almost 80 feet below sea level. He called his colleagues and the television crew to see the mysterious underwater circles. No one would have believed him if he had gone back with the story. It was later discovered that the culprit was the puffer fish, who, by flapping its fins, worked tirelessly to carve the circular ridges. Puffer fish are considered a delicacy in Japan, although they are poisonous. The fish is known to take small cells and crack them to line the inner grooves of their sculpture and decorate their piece. The ridges and grooves attract females. They lay eggs in the center of these undersea circles after the males and have prepared the site for them. Before confirming the culprit of these crop circles, there have been speculations that aliens might have a hand in it. 2. Miss Zenobia Miss Zenobia was a Swedish-built ferry built in 1979. It sank only one year after its first voyage. The wreck now rests on its port side around 138 feet of water near Larnaca, Cyprus. This ferry left Malmo, Sweden in May 1980, loaded with tractor trailers and other cargo. Between Cyprus and Athens, it began experiencing some mechanical faults because too much ballast water was pumped in. After ejecting the excessive water, the captain headed to Larnaca, the second to last stop. As it was in the harbor, the same issues resurfaced. This time, the engineers traced it to the computerized pumping system and a software glitch. Since the issues worsened, the captain decided to tow the ship away from the harbor to prevent it from becoming an obstruction should it sink. Unfortunately, it sank five days after arriving in Larnaca with all the cargo inside. Thank goodness no casualty was recorded. The Zen is a perfect dive for all divers, irrespective of your expertise. It starts at 16 meters, but only wreck-qualified divers can penetrate the accommodation blocks and car deck. 1. Mariana Trench The Mariana Trench is located in the Pacific east of the Philippines. It covers 124 miles east of the Mariana Islands. The distance between the surface of the ocean and the trench's deepest point, the Challenger Deep, lies 200 miles southwest of the U.S. territory of Guam. Researchers say if Mount Everest were dropped into the Mariana Trench, its peak would be over a mile underwater. The Mariana Trench is a global network of deep troughs cut across the ocean floor. It forms when two tectonic plates collide. In 1875, HMS Challenger said the trench measured about five miles. In 1951, researchers returned to the site and concluded the area was seven miles deep. The majority of this area is now a U.S. protected zone. To undertake research in the area, you need permission from the government. So far, the Challenger Deep, the Sirena Deep, and the U.S. Fish and Wildlife have permits to explore the area. Due to its depth, the Mariana Trench is clothed in perpetual darkness, with temperatures only a few degrees above freezing. Scientists have since debated the possibilities of life existing under such extreme conditions. The ocean is indeed an incredible place where the most unimaginable happens. Thanks for watching, and while you are still here, make sure to click the video on your screen for more mind-blowing videos. I'll see you there.